Manny, can you explain why you think you won the fight? I mean, I, I thought I, I, I thought I won the fight. I mean, uh, you know, I have to review the the, the DVD now in hotel, so if uh, really uh, I love the fight because um, especially um, I heard him many times. Not not uh, I heard him many times, and we can see that. And, and we was in ring in the play, um, but he didn't get hurt me. How many times do you think you really hurt him in the fight? How many? Him? Like uh, three, four times. And, uh, you think I, that was enough to win the fight? Huh? You, you could believe that was enough to carry the fight, win the fight? Well, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not um, saying that yeah, it's hard to say uh, right now, but uh, like what I said, I have to review, to review the, the DVD, the, the fight. And, and you have my question for Freddie. Freddie uh, did, uh, did Manny follow my game plan? What's your overall assessment of the fight? Uh, he did pretty well. I mean, I think we're working on putting him, just putting him close to the ropes, using footwork to keep him guessing when we were coming and going, and yeah, I think it worked quite well. And I thought those flurries that when he had him on the ropes were very effective. But you know, we just didn't do enough of it. And uh, once he told me that the shoulder was hurting and he was having trouble throwing it, um, it was difficult to get uh, to those punches off more often in the fight. But, um, uh, again, uh, again, I thought it was a very close fight. I thought he did well, but um, I, I know he can do a lot better, of course. Or Manny, you know, usually throws punches at angles more, and so this fight appeared to be that he was coming straight forward and you know, squaring up a lot more. Is that part of the plan? Well, um, backing him up was part of our plan, taking charge of the fight, yes, and putting him on the ropes and outscoring him on the ropes was the big part of the plan, but we just couldn't be, be as consistent as we wanted to be because the shoulder did start hurting more, and, you know, the jab and the uppercut was okay, but the hook was a little hard for him to throw. Hey, Freddie, I was going to ask you, uh, right here, Freddie. Before the fight, you had said that uh, you thought Floyd's legs were going on, but he, he moved a lot in this fight, it went pretty well. How would you rate his legs in this fight, the last couple of fights, and also in terms of how did you think he brought the fair defensively? I thought he ran very well. <laughs> I mean, uh, you know what, when, when he wasn't like in the punches, he was just running and moving backwards, and, I feel maybe he should have won a lot of those rounds because he's an aggressor. I mean, but um, we need to think of that way. Bob, to your right a little bit. I'll leave that to you. Come on. Bob, I just wanted to ask how fair you think it is for people who spent $99 on this fight, spent the money for these tickets, that you staged a fight with an injured fighter. You knew he was hurt, and you're saying that that was a reason why he was unable to throw one of his best punches. Athletes always fight uh, hurt. Uh, we felt uh, that uh, the uh, 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 work that was done on the shoulder during training would give him the opportunity to use the right hand. Uh, we were disappointed when in the third round the injury kicked up again, but this is always the case in sports. You know, you, you, a guy is injured in training, uh, he then uh, uh, deals with the injury, he thinks he's uh, conquered it, uh, and then he gets re-injured in the game. It happens in football, it happens in every sport. Manny, over here to your left. Throughout the bout, there were times that you seemed like you were hesitant of pulling the trigger. What was holding you up from doing that? I'm hesitant to, to, uh, to be uh, more aggressive because it's only one hand. I just, uh, I just uh, my right hand is just for pain and then only left hand I can use it.
and it's hard to, to fight one. I mean, you, you guys sort of fight yourself, right? And when you review the film, you'll see how infrequently you'll see how infrequently you threw the right hand. Let's welcome the champion. Great fight. Great fight.